Fucking TV here. We should go to Party City. Dollar Tree. Party City Dollar Tree. No, fuck you, Dollar Tree. Let's, it's fine. Let's go to Party City. We still gotta work so much stuff here, but we do see something here. Like, you know, not here, but the piano's over here. But they got the costumes over here. Some fall stuff. And then they'll probably go back together. This is what Palmo. And then here's some costumes. This is where they had the Halloween stuff for now. Um, oh, again with the shitty frozen. I uh, got a uh, trick or treat. Uh, uh, strawberries. That's where trick or treat is. We got some hanging weepers. I don't think they do anything. And then we got a, a little nice ghost here. Some spider webs. Some spiders. Um, a lot, mostly just costumes here. Not much decorations. But yeah, I still think the weepers are pretty cool though. And then here's some more stuff on top hat. Uh, some more makeup, I guess. Oh, uh, yep. And yeah, I know that my friend travels from Guitars and Girls works at the Party City Wedding Hills. We are going to be there next Friday. And he commented on my on my Party City or Spirit Halloween Wedding Hills video for 2019 saying that, that they, he said that the store, we, this, uh, the work, I'm using shelves here. Costumes, yeah. Not that shit again. Well, anyways, like I was saying, uh, the time to go start in the comments on that sphere video for 2019 when he was saying that the Party City store over there has has been remodeled and they got some Halloween stuff over there. So, yep, we're going to be visiting over there. And he did say he's going to be working that day next Friday. So, yep, we'll, hopefully we'll see him there. And, yeah, I think, uh, I think, you know, I think not much here besides costumes and all the hanging reapers. But, yeah, we'll probably see more soon in, in, later on the season. But, yep, yeah, I'll see some new animatronics here and stuff. So, yep. Yeah, now we're gonna let's go I think the summer stuff we still got some summer stuff over here. Like yeah. There's still like a, some summer stuff here that oh here's some more costumes, more of the shitty ass clothes and shit right there. Okay, then pinatas, yeah. They got uh shitty ass ugly doll uh pinata from that bad movie from a few years ago. So yeah. Okay, now let's go to Dollar Tree. Right. But before we do Dollar Tree, we just noticed that we have the some signs saying that well Halloween is coming, you boot you, which will be somewhere here. Like here's some price tags, like we got some Sally stuff, and some uh, lots of Top Gun. We still have some price tags coming here, so these price tags will give us a preview of what's coming over here. So yeah, oh right. yeah, there's some plans right here for some Halloween, if you can, can, we can focus on, you can see right there. There's the swords and staffs. Oh yeah, this is where the fake weapons will be. Okay, uh, I think we've seen enough here from Party City, let's go to Dollar Tree, which is right next door from here. Okay, we have made it to the Dollar Tree, so uh, we might see something, I'm not sure, but I do see what a fall, like fall four in the back over there. I just see what you're there. Uh, what are they requiring? I know it's really confusing. Yeah. Not, see, this is the CDC is requiring everyone to wear masks now. This was not like that before. Let's go in. I was wrong. I guess masks are not required for vaccinated, so yeah. I'm taking it off. So I use some Halloween. Oh, I do. Wow, look at this. Hang on a sec. I uh, put my mask in my pocket, but we got some lighter things here. As, yeah, as, as expected, Dollar Tree is not going to have any extra stuff because this stuff is going to be even. Everything's in the store, everything in the store is a dollar. So oh, they got the, those again. Those Yep, everything in here is a dollar, so it's going to be all like, like junk stuff. Those are the same from last year, I believe. Yeah, look at those. Staples? Like all these? No, I mean, this and this. They have oh, yeah, they have those over here, yeah. And then uh, here's some fall stuff. I, guess, I think this is the year I have Halloween, so here is the fall for not much. And then there's some signage for the home and stuff. Some f Halloween cards. Here's a fall aisle. Like pumpkin, yeah. Yeah, this is the Dollar Tree. Okay, um, I did see a couple fall for over video. Okay, I guess we can look at the rest of the store now since we do have some time to kill. So let's see if we can find the movies. I haven't checked the weekly while. I have to go back outside to see what the weekly while is to see the offway movies in the weekly while. Let me go well, check. I mean, we can... Yeah, the weekly things are in front. And let's see what we got for the weekly while. Not, this is what movies. It looks like clothing. For, I think for school year. I was yeah, just clothing for the weekly while today. So, uh, alright. Let's see if we can. Oh, yeah. oh, they got school supplies again. Yeah, Target, Walmart, and Maya will have their school supplies before Halloween. So, we gotta wait till September for that. So, now let's see if we can find the movies. I've got the flashcards for your math and shit right now. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, 2022 calendar from Dollar Store. These are very generic, wow. They're like, like flowers and stuff like that. That's uh, This is very generic, by the way. It's just enough. It's just a plain, regular, boring, old calendar. That, yeah, generic calendar. Like, average, everyday calendar. You use for your work desk and stuff. Okay. 
probably those heads are cool though. Those are the days of the dead skeletons because they coat on, I think. Alright. Let's go take a look. Oh, they got flamingos here. Okay, again. Let's go see if we can find the movies. So we have lots of movies to look for. So let's start from here. Look at all the movies. Wow, look at all that. It's just amazing. These bones and like they always make a mess of this stuff here. So I think it's gonna be a lot of these uh, like uh, oh. low budget movies, so like that. <laughs> We're gonna see a lot of low budget movies like from Magnet, Magnolia, whatever. <laughs> oh yeah, and anything we run too. So not sure if we're buying anything today, but yeah. Um, this oh my try back and film. Wait. We got lots of movies. Yeah. Oh. Fairy tales don't have the ending. Wow, look at that. Uh, is this like a rip off or something? I don't know. But it looks really Probably. bad, especially if it's way G. Top Cat's cool. This is uh, this is a low budget Top Cat movie. What the hell? Um, and yeah. Usually, Top Cat's not usually. You know, this company is steering one. This is what you own by Warner Brothers and Hamble Bear. This company is steering their content. That's how well budgeted they are. They're steering people's content. Um, this inc it's ridiculous. They got Velcro Experiment, though. That's a good film. You want to get it? Do we have to buy it somewhere? It's like. We have a copy, but I don't think we have the original. I don't know. Maybe. We'll see if they find anything else. Yeah, it's only a dollar, though, so can't beat that. Um, Let's see if we find anything else. Yeah. And then after we're done with the movies, of course, the guy worked with the two widow sodas and water too to see what kind of interesting things we have over there. And that's how we end off our videos. Always see what the Dow Show. This is cool. I don't think I have it. I think I have this, but it has a different outlook. I can't remember. I might have a Shrek version. I think I'm going to get it anyway since uh, I believe I do have the Shrek version, but not the Kung Fu Panda version, so I'm going to get it. So yeah. I, I can't remember honestly, but, I, uh, but yeah, it looks cool though. I guess I'll get it for the old guy now. Sure. I even have Shrek or Comfort Panda, but it's one of those albums that are just generic and they use we use every time, but that's pretty cool. Um, and if you want to look for more movie reviews and stuff, go to I'll go up yes frozen or twelve four DCP to look for my movie grade content. Aww. You won't find it here, but you'll find it at uh, that channel. And we got more of the whip off host of Transylvania Monster Family here. They had this at Big Lots too, so these that's why most of these discount places will have this, so yeah. Don't buy it's a piece of shit. Um, yeah. I think that's it for the movies, I guess. And what is this? I think this is a rip off of that Pirates movie from Alderman and DreamWorks, which looks really bad, so don't buy it. Um, this is, an, I think, a re I think this is probably a, a rip off of The Great Mouse Detective from Disney, another really bad film. Entertainment One, yeah. All right. Okay. Um. Wow. I think this might be a rip off of the Nut Job and uh. For the producer, Shrek, he, wow, he makes a lot of things, but but this one is really like low budget. What the hell? This looks like probably a I don't know what we bought this is, but it looks really bad. So yeah, a lot of surprising things for the producer Shrek. He always makes these surprising movies, you know. And then this one, it looks like a whip off for Arnold movie. I'm not sure which one, but this looks really bad as well. When wax always in the way, uh, we're also in the waiting section. This is one of the white bulbs I got back last year at the Dollar Tree and. Uh, yeah, that Top Cat's well budget. It's not even made by Warner Brothers or Hannibal. Wait, what is that? That's a different one. Yeah, this is definitely a, a whip off right here. Not like from Warner Brothers or Hannibal. Bear. This company is serious people concept. Seriously, that's just ridiculous. All right, um, uh, more of these horror films, action films, crime films. Another whip off movie for kids. Uh, what is this? Oh my god, this whip off for the Wassy films or the Beethoven film or other, any dog film for the family? Wow. Lots of really bad movies here. Yeah. Same thing at Big Lots, lots of bad movies. We've been going on for a while now, so we should. I think we don't need. I think I'm only getting two titles for like two, so yep. Um, I don't see another copy of Terror Tales. You want to pick up Tales? Oh yeah, you want to pick up Terror Tales? Which one is it? It's called Terror Tales. I thought I wanted to see one. Oh yeah, Wait, can you help me find it? Okay, I am picking up Taylor Taylor, so, uh, yeah, I think I'm picking up two title, three titles for three bucks. Um, anything else? Okay, I guess we'll find, uh, drinks, get some refreshment on here, getting retired. Now we got a fairy who's wearing a mask, so I don't know what happened, yeah. Well, if you're vaccinated, you don't need to wear it, so just take care. Okay, here's some cleaning supplies, we can drink, uh, no, not over here, but they got flour for us, so. I think the drinks are over here. 
Okay, we made it to drink, so we got chips over here. So let's look at the drink. Um, we got some juice here. The Sunny D. I think you see that on my too. too. Um, hints of uh, Propel Gateway. I see uh, drink mixes from juice and, you know, water. We, they have a ton of this at, like, Dollar Tree Big Lots. They have a ton of that, the alkaline water. It's a really alkaline water, no, sometimes a lot of you, like, um, can't remember what brand it was. I think it was, uh, something, I don't know. But some of those off-brand ones. Here, it got stars and stripes again, so, yeah, but it is past the 4th of July, so I think this stars and stripes soda is not based on 4th of July. I think this is the new brand from Fago, so, yeah, but that's pretty cool. Uh, yeah, I've honestly thought that the Stars and Stripes soda is only for the 4th of July, but I know I think it's all year round, so yeah. Pretty interesting and weird at the same time. You turn in the water, those are the mountain water made out of the mountains that are expensive but good. Those you feel like pretty acidic water, uh, lemonade, blueberry lemonade, that's pretty weird. So you got, for Stars and Stripes, you got all, you got all your favorite soda flavors like lemon wine, orange, fruit punch, root beer, diet cola, and cola. And then there's a couple of fago things that are maybe odd for the market seems to get it while I can. Um, yep. And then here's the popcorn which will end off here. Um, pop secret. Uh, that's a uh, popcorn. Um, actually, we're not that great. Oh yeah, I think we did. It's just like shit, I believe. Okay. Okay, I think there's nothing else for you to see in the store. So yep, I'm gonna go now. But before we go, please enjoy this real Halloween video I took at Highland Park last week. And we will be back there tomorrow. So make sure to tune in with the Chucky TV channel. Um, for that new video tomorrow and on tomorrow's Let's Go Shopping video. So yeah, because we'll be in the area because we'll be going to a concert at Ravinia Festival and then we'll do another party city video and then also one just right down the back from the Park. So yeah, please enjoy this video and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.